Before I came to the House of Health, I was going through some very troubled times, me and my son. Um, we actually became homeless. And um, I actually met Pastor Ray and Pastor Tony through my phone. Uh, my phone number, I changed my phone number, and it ended up being Pastor Ray's number as I'm going through the midst of everything. Um, so I started getting all his text messages, um, Pastor Ray this, Pastor Ray that, and I'm like, who is this Pastor Ray? <laughs> so I'm saying, you have the wrong number, you have the wrong number, and then finally someone says, I'm pulling up right now. <laughs> pulling up where? <laughs> so I said, um, could you please tell Pastor Ray that uh, to, that he has his number changed, that everything, his number has changed and that this is a new number. And um, so he contacted me and he said, you know, um, could you forward the, the messages and everything like that to my phone? And I said, yeah, no problem. Um, but as I'm going through the midst of everything, I, I felt led to contact them and let them know my situation with me and my child. And they reached out like this. They, uh, I actually, they asked me how much of an emergency it was. I didn't know that it was a serious emergency, so I ended up being in um, a shelter. And they came to the shelter, um, and they took me from the shelter and brought me here to the House of Health. So me and my son actually reside here at the House of Health. Um, it's not a residential. So they uh, personally helped me. They um, moved us in here, and we've been living here. We, um, this place is extremely important to us because uh, without them, I honestly, I couldn't give you one hint of where we would be right now. And uh, they've been a major blessing to, to, to me and my child. Uh, Pastor Tony, she's been like a mother to me. Um, I've grown up in the foster homes, and I've lived in maybe roughly about 25 homes um, as a teen, like 12 to 17, and before I was adopted from one to four. Um, and so I've, I haven't really found a home or a mother or a father figure. And uh, Pastor Ray they, and Pastor uh, Tony, they filled in that position. And um, they've been like a grandmother and a, a grandfather to my, to my son also. And, um, it's a, it's a really delicate situation, but uh, they've, they've helped me so much that, um, I don't know, I can't, I just can't fathom right now life without the House of Help. They really help.